All right, guys, here's the central Ybor city area. We're gonna go ahead and do a walking tour of this area. So, uh, this is a Cuban town. We got the light. So Ybor City is a uh, it's a city here in the in the in the Tampa Bay area. It's actually right off downtown Tampa. This is actually known as one of the most dangerous areas of Tampa. So we're gonna go ahead and see if we can check it out. This so the Ritz Theater it used to be an old theater back then. Now it's like a club. Yeah, this whole area is all basically nightclubs. There is a, a huge Cuban presence here, Cuban community here. Uh, they still roll a lot of cigars by hand, hand rolled cigars. They keep the cigars so they could stay nice and fresh. And by the looks of it, they got quite a bit of uh, homemade cigars. Okay, as Kenny was saying, this is the humidor area where all the cigars are kept in a humid and controlled environment. Uh, Ybor City is actually produces more than 500 million cigars a year. So uh, let's go ahead and keep checking out this place. All right, so that's one of the cigar shops. La Faraona. As you can see they're doing some repairs. Uh, yet another cigar shop. Sin Corona. This is a famous cigar shop. <laughs> Centro Español. My aunt used to tell me about this place. They used to have like Cuban dances and uh, it was like a gathering place. There you go. Kenny is quite the tour guide here. And here we have the famous 7-Eleven. I don't know if you've ever heard of the famous 7-Eleven, but apparently it's super famous and it's all over the country. And here to the right we have Central Ebor. Uh, you mean to the left? Uh, the other. The left. other right. Uh, yes. <laughs> so let's go ahead and go into these little this little area, Central Ebor. There's a bunch of shops. We got a statue of Roland M. Mantiga. So we'll have to Google exactly why they made a statue. Hello, ma'am. There you go. <laughs> So over here we got a movies and shops, a church, a church. That, that's a church? Yeah. There you go, that's a church right there. I think, I think they're actually doing Bible study right now in there. So here we go. Uh, 
Comedy Club, the Improv. Oh yeah, the famous Improv in Ebor. So there you go. The famous Improv here in Ebor City. Huge comics come, come down here. Do all their little comedy skits here. We, we go that way and we come back that way. They actually have a uh, they have a, 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 a rail system here, which you can see here. They're they're called streetcars. There's actually one way down there. Let's see if I can zoom in. That streetcar is actually free and uh, they, they go all the way around this area they go towards the they go all the way towards the uh, the stadium where the Tampa Bay Lightning actually play hockey let's see if maybe we can catch one of these little trains Actually, if we get on this train, it's probably going to take us far away from where we parked. So <laughs> we only paid for an hour of parking. So let's not get on the train. This is the station where you get on and off the... So yeah, right the here. Trolley. So here's the, the trolley station right here. You can get it on and off. So this one goes the channel side and downtown. Central Ebor, 8th Avenue, 16th Street. That's what this station is called. All right, let's go back. All right, so we're gonna be heading back towards 7th Avenue. 7th Avenue is basically where all the main shops, all the clubs are. So go ahead, we're gonna go ahead and head back in that direction. So there it is, Central Ebor. I don't know if you can see with the sun. There it is, Central Ebor. This whole section, this whole area. Okay, yes. So they say that this is a dangerous area. Doesn't seem to be dangerous right now. Perhaps maybe when the sun goes down and at night it's different. Ice cream shop. You're in the noodles and bars. There's a noodle bar right there. Bar <laughs> noodle. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. This is also. I didn't know they had all this stuff here. Yeah, they have like little shops, a whole bunch of little things to do. Uh, it's like an Asian, it's Thai food, Asian noodle bar right here. Yes, this is awesome. So if you like Asian food, you like Thai food, you can come to Ybor City, you go to that little shop right there. Here, and a, and a little something extra. You, <laughs> I'm gonna go with a no on this one. <laughs> yeah, little pizzerias, Ebor supermarkets, so that guy is knocked out. We just crossed the road illegally. We didn't wait for the walk sign. So please be careful. Be aware of your surroundings and don't do. Do not do, jaywalk down here. Do not jaywalk. Do not do what we do. Well, check out this building. It's an Italian club. Union Italiana. Look, there goes a chicken crossing the road. Are you serious? Where's the chicken? 
Oh, yep, Ybor City is huge with chickens. So let's go ahead and, I don't know if you can see it way out there. So why did the chicken cross the road? Because he wanted to. The chickens are actually protected animals here. You can't, you can't hurt them, you can't kill them, you can't do anything to them. They've been around here since the beginning of Ybor City back in the early 1900s when the first Cuban immigrants came in here and established this town as their own. Another cigar shop right there, La Hacienda de Ibur. There's a chicken right there. In front of that tattoo shop or that. Let's go see if we can. We'll, we'll, we'll catch them on the way back if you want. Let's go. No, 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 that's fine. We're going to go ahead and see if we can cross the road so we can be just like the chicken that crossed the road. There's another chicken. Over there. There's another There's another famous restaurant here called the Columbia Restaurant. So the Columbia Restaurant has been around since 1905. And it's, it takes up a whole, a whole block here in Ybor. It's 52,000 square feet. They have, it started off, it's the oldest Spanish restaurant, Spanish slash Cuban restaurant in all of Florida or the whole US I believe. We got all these little murals out here. Together we will be better, a better world. Viva America and Puerto Rico. Viva Ibor. All right, here is the famous Colombia restaurant right there. This is the oldest Spanish restaurant in the US and there it is established since 1905. It's a Spanish slash Cuban restaurant. They say that they have the, I've actually never eaten here. Uh, Kenny, I think Kenny has. Yeah, it's uh, all the way down there. That's the restaurant. This, this whole restaurant is a block, a whole block. Yeah, but it also has a shop. It has. They give a, a, a flamenco dancing show. They, they they have a lot here. That's why it's so famous. It's been here for so long. Yeah. They say they have the best Cuban Cuban sandwiches. So let's go ahead, and we're gonna go ahead back down Seventh Avenue, back towards our cars. We just gotta wait. Okay, we got it. So we got the walk sign now. Yeah, so again, this place has uh, shops, it has flamenco dancers, all sorts of things here. Nice doggy. Underdog. <laughs> or something close. Something close to underdog. Yes. <laughs> I drove I 
parking everywhere. There's chickens everywhere. She has a leg of rain on it. See the parking lot? We got some fine feathered friends in here. Again, the, 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 the chickens here are actually protected animals. You can't mess with them. You can't. I guess they're they, everywhere. Yes, everywhere. You got to be careful not to run them over. Maybe you can shoo them away. But don't hurt the chickens. Outside. Yeah, look at this old thing. Squeezer thing. <laughs> it's a <laughs> an old squeezer. The buffalo, the I missed the buffalo. The blind tiger. That tiger's blind. What is this? Cafe tea and textile. There you, you there you go. There uh, you go. Wait. Oh, don't walk. Ke Kenny is very, uh, he likes to follow the law, which I highly appreciate that. No jaywalking. No jaywalking here. So follow the rules. Go. There we go. Walk. Oh, here we go, our, our first chicken. Get over here, chicken. There you go, chickens everywhere. So this is uh, Central Ybor, or Ybor City. It is pretty nice to be a dangerous city. Well, thanks. Gaspar de Grotto. Grotto. Food, drinks, and live music. There's a ghost rider right there. Ghost rider truck. Look both ways before crossing the street. That's a good idea. The Italian club. Italiano. We'll get the best Cuban sandwiches in Cuba. We got a bad monkey. Bad, bad monkey. Nice pirate right there. Well, I hope you guys are enjoying this tour of Ybor City. Hey, so I want to thank everyone that's subscribed so far to this channel. For everyone, thank you for everyone that's watched these videos. Uh, again, I want to continue to grow this channel, bringing different things, new places. Perhaps maybe you you won't ever be able to make it here to Tampa or the other places that I've been to, but hopefully through this channel you guys can explore along with Kenny and myself and uh, hope you guys can enjoy. Uh, yeah, if you guys have any suggestions of places we should go to walk around, 
places to eat or, or even just look at, uh, leave a comment down below and we'll try to do it for you. Cigar shops and another chicken. Quite a bit of in interesting characters, better said. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. That's not good. That's not good at all. And Tango, the people who own Tango, the best are pretty much a lot of stuff. Alright guys, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the tour. I uh, hope you guys were able to come here to Ybor City one day, check it out. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe and stay tuned for more videos.